Oh, hi guys, a um, bit more work on the pond, uh, house is no different, still no sign of the insurance, but uh, keep digging, oh, I can't see it being this side of Christmas, two weeks, three weeks left. Um, I've started to uh, put the sides up on the filter house and uh, Roof choice. So I'll uh, turn you around, show you quickly. So I'll put these boards, uh, OSB boards, it's just a bit of scrap I had, just fell. I'm going to uh, lath over the top of that, it's for extra insulation, it's just so it brings it out enough so when I clad the wall, uh, it'll sit underneath. So we refer to just tarp on the top for the moment. I'll take you around. There's going to be an opening window there, hopefully, if I can get one. Or I'll have to make one. Uh, doorway, just got to put a strap across, across there. All that's going to be blocked in uh, with blocks. Inside, and you say, you see the, the joists? These are all timbers off it, old climbing frame, still got the climbing bit on. So we'll be able to hang things off there or even climb up if it needs be. Um, yeah, I'm leaving this open so I can see into the pond. Filter will go here uh, and then piped up via pump into a moving bed that will sit across here and then into the um, oh, uh, the tube filter, I can't think what it's called now. Um, yeah, the filter through UV and back through the returns. Um, the block, sitting blocks all along here, flat which will give me a shelf and then I'm going to build off the back. I don't know if I go part of the way up and then clad the rest or go straight up. Um, depends on how many blocks I've got. All this greenery will be behind the wall because I didn't want to take it out and just cut it back. Um, so we can keep on growing. So yeah, so we're on this wall, I'm going to have a uh, junction box with all my electrics, um, a light for the light, a light switch, uh, probably go on here, uh, the door's going to open outwards. Yeah, so obviously the return was there. Um, it's got space really, especially with the shelf that will go to about here, and then the block work will come up. Um, I'll have food to fit me moving bed on, um, and anything else really. Put some shelves up. Uh, it'd be better when I've boarded all this out as well. I've put a a boarding there which is going to be a full store so I can get behind the pond because uh, obviously the shower is going there and then all the pipe work is coming here um, bottom drains covers on uh, some water in there we've got to wash it down and give it to cut either out uh, still got to get the coopers Yes, yeah, it's, it's so far so good. Uh, I'm just getting that just paint in here. That's obviously the window frame. The wind will sit in there. I'm hoping to get a PVC one, to be honest. Um, 
the, uh, I went over with the black block work a little bit because um, obviously I was judged by the, the piece of wood going across. So I fastened this post to that and then fastened it to the wall as well. Um, I did have a slight, slight incident where the wall cracked, but uh, I've sorted that out now, it's pretty solid. Um, I'm going to cut that block bit of block out because the hinges are going to go on here and then shut to this. So yeah guys, I've just put some more blocks uh, down. I've got cement them in yet, but I just thought I'd put them in to see, see if it actually looks okay before I uh, bed them on. Um, I'll turn you around quickly. So you can see. That's going to be the shelf. Oh my gosh, and blocks up. Like I say, I don't know if to put a cap in on top and then build timbers off that up to the roof. Uh, you won't see any of this then. Uh, we'll just build straight up with blocks. I'll run them straight across and then across there as well. Just uh, well, level with the pond, I think. And then just there. Um, pipe's got to come through there. Um, this one. If I can, I might go straight up with that one. So yeah, still got paint in this. Lights on at the moment. Yeah, so what do you think, guys? I think uh, they're giving me a bit more room. I think, uh, let's see if I can measure it. Everything's hard when you want handed. So the shelf. will be one foot one so if I say a foot depth I'm saying then the moving bed will go here with the tempest and then well maybe here tempest on the wall and then UV running back to the uh, returns Slowly but surely. Might take them off yet and just clad it and then polystyrene inside. Give you a look, quick look at the fish. I'm sitting there. Not moving much at all. Let's see where this net is on. So I'm going to leave that open uh, for now anyway, I might change it to, I don't know, uh, we'll even put a window in so I can open it up I need to be. On top of the filter I'm going to have a, a drop down sh shelf, so it's like a workbench over top. So yeah guys, uh, hope you enjoyed the update. Um, I'll keep posting videos as often as I can. Um, and uh, 
thank you again for all the subscribers and the likes and the comments um, I think I'm on 166 now so I'm heading towards the 200 so uh, I think uh, my aim is once I get to 200 I'll, I'll do a uh, small giveaway uh, not sure what yet I'm still leaking um, but um, as you know it's a tough time of the year Christmas around the corner million one things to do um, I say uh, a week in a school so uh, I'm at the moment doing all the backdrop for the stage uh, ready for the nativity uh, I'll put a picture on to show you if I can um, it's not quite finished yet I've got to uh, tomorrow to finish it but yeah um, I'll say the house I don't know where it'll be but uh, it'll be a nice gift for the new year if they actually turn around and said uh, we're coming in but um, kitchen first so uh, I've started taking the unit out bit by bit but yeah uh, um, anyway guys I um, hope you enjoyed it uh, please uh, comment below subscribe like press the bell uh, all the updates um, and uh, I'll see you on the next one cheers guys thanks very much